have absolutely no regrets when I look back of the choice we made to come here as our family. And I think that's so cool to be able to say that. You know, after all these years, it was the right choice. And maybe one of the, the greatest things about being here on the Sunshine Coast is the ability to balance work and lifestyle. The best part of working with the other physicians on the coast and part of what kind of sealed the deal or the contract to come here was the incredible group of physicians. It's a really nice mix, I think, now of new in practice, fresh physicians, mm -hmm. and then at the same time, some who've been here for 30, 40 years. The people here are very nice. They, they, are, they are very friendly. That's one thing about the coast. What I like about living on the coast is how peaceful it is. Our lives are um, busy, it's a little bit crazy, and so having that sense of calm, um, it's really important to me. I take the ferry and you get onto the coast and the stress just melts. There's something different about the atmosphere here that it just, it feels different. One of the best things about living on the coast is that you can jump on a ferry and you can be there downtown, you know, and you can be there in an hour or two and you can do your shopping and then you can leave it all behind. You rarely have to wait for the ferry. It's quick on and off. I'm door to door to my parents' place in two hours from our place here, and that's the same as living in Abbotsford. I'm happy to say that uh, over the 10 years that we've been here, um, between having lots of microbreweries and a lot of different restaurants opening and a new demographic emerging, there's actually a lot to do here. We've seen orca whales in the summertime. We've had a bear, bear in our at the front, front and door. backyard. <laughs> Deer roaming through, eating our garden. The outdoor activities here are phenomenal in terms of hiking and kayaking. Um, we can do cross-country skiing here, beach combing and beach walking. I love that I can go and take my dogs for a walk up on the mountain and be in the middle of nowhere and be enjoying nature and then come on down and go to my clinic later in the day. Uh, one of the unique things about the Sunshine Coast is that we live and work on the unceded lands of the Squamish Nation and the Seashell Nation. I really appreciate that there's opportunities for learning about um, our history and um, I look forward to deeper collaborations with, with all the First Nation people. Professionally, I really value the fact that there's a lot of opportunity for diversity in practice here. It's been indescribable, the, the extent to which I've been supported and continue to be supported to do what works for me and, and my, my well-being. The most satisfying part of being a doctor on the Sunshine Coast is the ability to diversify, to work in a full scope um, practice. Being able to work in the emergency room keeps me active, keeps me busy, and I'm happy with my life here. I love having a full practice. I love being a rural physician where I can deliver babies, I can work in the emergency department. I develop a really wonderful relationship with my patients. I go to their homes when they die. I get to care for my patients in the hospital, which is really satisfying medicine. Uh, when you're in the city and you're looking at joining the local divisions of family medicine or the doctors of BC or any of the, any of the actual lobbying groups, you don't really get that opportunity in your early years of practice. And I'm the current chair for the divisions, I'm on the hospital boards. It's really nice that I can get to the real core of the matters and affect real change early in my career. There's a, a, a wide variety of things that you can do, both in and out of facility. Um, but it is, it is one of the benefits of living here is that I don't, I don't think there's a limit to what you could experience. The advice that I would give to other physicians considering coming to a community like the Sunshine Coast is recognizing it is a rural and sometimes remote community. There's a level of responsibility that you've got to be willing to take to, to practice in a community like this. When I think about the other places that I could have been, I just feel so blessed and lucky that we fell into this wonderful community, this wonderful hospital community, and for raising my family, community, and friends. If I had known about it, I would have been here five years earlier. And I think once you come up here, you really understand what a magical, unique pocket of British Columbia and of the world it is, and you just wish you had been here earlier.